Channel 2 Action News investigates an alleged defect in the engines that power some of Chrysler, Job, Dodge, and Jeep's most popular and profitable cars and trucks. It is called the Hemi Tick. Channel 2 consumer investigator Justin Gray with us here. Uh, Justin, a lawsuit alleges that the Hemi Tick could be quite dangerous. Justin Chrysler has never issued any recalls for the Hemi Tick. The plaintiffs want this 135 page lawsuit to turn into a class action, which would end up including everyone in the same situation. The lawsuit alleges that not only is the Hemi Tick expensive to fix, but also that it can lead to crashes. I'm always afraid it's going to cut off and someone's going to hit me or I'm going to have a wreck or something. Donna Goyne says it's a fear every time she gets behind the wheel of her 2016 Ram 1500. When Goyne's fired up the truck, we heard the source of her worry right away. The so-called Hemi Tick. Just like a knocking sound, it's like a tick, 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 and it just keeps doing that. This lawsuit alleges a design flaw in certain Hemi V8 engines from 2014 to 2022, including muscle cars like Dodge Challengers and Chargers, SUVs including Jeep Grand Cherokees, and trucks like Goins Ram. It's all the time. The lawsuit alleges the Hemi Tick is a safety concern that it could cause, quote, loss of power while driving, especially at highway speeds or while trying to merge or change lanes. We checked the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, or NHTSA, database and found more than 100 complaints dating back years with people describing the Hemi Tick. Just last week, one worried truck owner wrote, quote, Dealership claims that the tick, which is horrifically loud, is normal for these trucks. I am planning on having a third-party mechanic give a second opinion before paying to have the engine rebuilt. Chrysler sent out this bulletin to dealers describing the problem and the repair, but there's no recall, so customers are currently on the hook for the cost. The dealer told Goins it would cost $4,500 to fix her truck. Mad. <laughs> Very mad. And if you have this issue, take the vehicle to the dealer, if for no other reason than to document the problem. And if you spend any money because of the so-called tick, save your receipts in case there's a way to get reimbursed later. Fiat Chrysler Automobiles says it does not comment on pending litigation, but the company is discontinuing these Hemi engines, replacing them after the 2023 model year, Linda. I know you'll follow it, Justin. Thank you.